Wine students, how are you all? Hope you're fine with the grace of the Almighty God. So, students, I know that we have already started the explanation of the chapter, that is revision part, and our topic of the chapter is land of the midnight sun. As we have already discussed the story time, features of the Greenland, then uh, we came to know about the terrain, that the land of the type mentioned in the Greenland, then climates, okay, clothes, festival, language and religion, culture, plants, life, then today we will discuss about the animals' life. Okay. and also you will do the revision of the now i know okay from there we will do so let's start forward and start our revision okay the animals okay the animals found in the greenland are musk ox reindeer polar bear and white arctic okay white arctic wolf some domestic animals like sheep goats okay and pigs are also raised by inuits okay so there are some animals which are found into the means uh, Greenland. Okay, like it is mentioned about the animals like musk, ox, okay, reindeer, polar bear, white Arctic wolves. You can find them. Some of the domestic animals are also there, like sheep, goats. Also, you can find and pigs are also raised by the Inuit people. Okay, marine animals also you can find, like seals, whale rushes, and whales inhabited of the greenland okay you can find the whales okay which are inhabited of the greenland the whales are this type you can see the images here okay you can see the images here the whales are this type so different types of whales like blue whales you can find fin whale you can find humpback whale you can find pilot whale etc constitute the marine land make, make the water animals they are the water animals right fish such as cod and rockfish are also very useful for the economic purpose. Okay, the cod and the rockfish are also very uh, useful for the economic purpose. Okay, they, they are exported to the other regions and are the source of the revenue for the country. Okay, they are the important sources for the revenue of the country because they are also exported to the other countries, they are also sold to the other countries. Okay, then the Greenland shark is exploited for the oil present in its liver okay the greenland sharks okay in that uh, they are getting the special oil okay that are exported for this purpose they are killed and they are exported to the other countries there are great high demands are there the birds found in the greenland include petrels puffins and gulls arctic tern is a small bird that comes to the greenland during summer and goes to the south pole during the winters you see, Arctic tern is the smallest bird that comes into the Greenland. It is a very small in size. Okay, it is very small in size that comes into the Greenland. Okay, during the summer and it goes to the South Pole. Okay, it goes to the South Pole during the winter season. Okay, it goes to the South Pole during the winter seasons. Economy and industry, if you say, then Greenland is totally depend on the fishing and the export industry. Okay. Greenland is totally dependent upon the fishing and the export industry. So, shrimp export earns the large revenues. Reindeers, polar bears, seals, walruses, and whales are also important sources of the meat. Okay, these are the you see uh, polar bears are there, walruses, whales. These all are the important sources of the meat. Okay, for the Greenland. Then next, Greenland is also a hydroelectric power plant named. Works for tourism has also grown rapidly as a has benefited the economy. Okay, in the Greenland, there is a lot of the tourism has been given importance. Okay, mining of the ruby and other minerals like iron, uranium, then platinum, nickel, and copper is also being carried out at a large scale. Okay, you can get this thing at the large scale. At the abundant quantity, that is huge quantity you can get. Transport system, transport system if you say transport roads are also present only within the towns, docks, and the sledges and the snowmobiles are used on the ice covered areas. Shipping air services are the main means of transport in the Greenland. Greenland is also very sophisticated telephone uh, telecommunication network that is very you know uh, modern tele uh, modern type telecommunication network they are using. Then at the welfare services, what type of you can say good work which are done by the Greenland? Okay, in the welfare services, we must mention that the Greenland government, 
the government of the greenland provides free education okay to its provides a, its citizens a range of welfare services like free health care nine years of free and compulsory education for greenland children means in the few children those who are staying in the greenland they are compulsory to study okay they are compulsory to study up to nine years there will be free education will be given okay nine years of free education will be provided okay so students your chapters is completed this is the second part of the explanation so this is the last part of the explanation and the revision also so now i know if you see so let's go and, and see that now i know greenland lies in the northern hemisphere and is the largest island in the world it is capital is moved the official language is kalali shu okay so the official language of the greenland is what the kalali shu the natives of the greenlands are also called as inuits the they are all found at the kayak building and sailing the main me, uh, means of transport for the short distance distances are for the are the sledges and the snowmobiles greenland has one of the largest ice sheets in the world then greenland has mountain chains on the east west coast okay there is a wide variety of the animals marine mammals and the birds in the greenland next you will see that uh, the word meaning okay so study the word meaning properly see the time to think find out the reason why shark oil is very useful you have to think okay so in a very simple i'll say this girls are very fond of you know doing the makeup yes girls are very fond of doing makeups uh, they like to put the lipstick okay do you ever thought that how the lipstick is made out of have you ever thought that how the lipstick is made out of the it is made up of the you know oils of the fish like shark oil is also used so i hope that from the next time you will be thinking that i should put or not okay so so let's uh, like uh, look look the time to think of the uh, page number 10 we will see okay take a cube of the ice and hold it over fire okay take a cube of the ice and hold it over the fire watch it to melt you see and watch it the melt we are i have seen many times the same phenomena will happen to the greenland ice sheets if the global temperature keeps increasing if the same thing is going to happen if the you know when the temperature of the environment will increase as you know that today is now there are you know rapid increase of the temperature day before yesterday we were having 36 degrees celsius okay 36 degrees celsius temperature was there so our conditions was in some other places of the assam has, has also noticed 40 degrees celsius you think how the increase of the temperature is and how it is affecting the environment if the temperature goes above the melting of the ice no one can stop the same condition and the experiment which is told here will become in the greenland okay so time to think of the page number Nine by the area, Greenland is the world largest island. Okay, however, it is not regarded as a continent. Why? You you have to find the reason. Okay, you have to find the reason why it is not regarded as the continent. Okay. Next, we will see that uh, good to know. Okay, in the page number eleven, we will see the good to know in the page number eleven. A lot of people live in the south and southwestern coast of the Greenland and is the warmest part of the country. so you have to know the reason it is that uh, the a lot of people live in the southwestern coast of the greenland and it is also known as the warmest part of the country neither it you, you can feel too much hot also too much cold also it is a very good place in the, in the southern part of the coast of the greenland okay so friends we have already completed the explanation and the revision of the chapter i hope that you have understood the explanation and the revision of the chapter next class we will we'll start with the revision of chapter 9 your examination is very close to you i hope that you will study properly okay if you have doubt or something then you can you are free to call me up or even you can message me up you are free to call me and ask me that your doubts if you if you want any chapter question answers then also you can ask me okay if you have doubt or something you are free to call me okay thank you thank you so much okay bye bye